Tribal engagement. Uh, this was one of, one of the top priorities. We, at our inauguration, we had a tribal luncheon. First week, the Brenton Iron Office, we met with all the tribal leaders. Uh, we uh, had everybody come in. We have gone out and had meetings at all the tribes. Where are we? we? We had a long way to go. When we, I mean, trust was very, very low last year, and, and probably for good reasons. Uh, but in it, in it was, uh, but you know, we're digging in on this thing because it's so important to the future of our state. You know, what we have here is a history uh, that goes back before we were a state, long before North Dakota was here. Uh, in started in 1899, we've got you know tribal nations that were here with a complex mix of of you know, this tragic history and interaction with the feds and broken promises and uh, treaty debates that all happened before we got here, uh, forced assimilation, I mean, it is a tragic history. One of the challenges we have is not enough people in North Dakota understand that history. And the challenge that I'm gonna put out to all of you is to try to better understand that history. We need, we need people that really work to understand where we've been so that you can also understand what is the inspirational resolve of our tribal nations to try to work on behalf of their people to, to create better situations. And we have a federal system that is, I think, incredibly, the federal system is incredibly dysfunctional uh, and it has led to multi-generational poverty and lots of other challenges. And it's a, and, and we have to, whether it's you know, addiction, whether it's K through 12, whether it's higher ed, all of our other initiatives that we're working on also apply here. It's just that in this case, we're working on nation to nation relationships. And so we have to approach it a little bit differently, but we have to figure out a way to uh, work together to try to uh, re resolve that. And I'm grateful for the partnerships we've built with the leaders that are here. Uh, they've been incredible hosts. Uh, when Catherine and I have Brent have been there and uh, we wanna continue to keep those uh, dialogues going this year to work on the big issues that are, 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 are facing us. Uh, the, uh, some of those areas relate to uh, taxes. We've created, for the first time ever, a tribal taxation committee that was formed by the legislature. We've got the, the leaders from both parties, the tax commissioner, the lieutenant governor, myself, Scott Davis from Indian Affairs. It's a historic group of leaders that's uh, put together on one group to really put the leadership working on, on uh, on tribal relations in the, uh, from the legislature and the executive branch working together and we're hoping that that can lead to uh, legislation that can help uh, solve some of the challenges that we're facing. Uh, but we need to listen more uh, and we have to understand and those of it, you know, if you get out and spend time listening, you understand it, it, yes, we're separate nations. We're all North Dakotans, we're all parents. We've all got kids. We all want the same thing. Bright future for the children, opportunity, safety. You know, we all want the same thing. Let's go figure out how to get it done. Uh, we had a chance to attack uh, 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 Jamie, who's here. Uh, congratulations on your new responsibilities. Uh, but th thank you for hosting and inviting Catherine and I up to the Addiction Summit uh, that, is, uh, that happened last summer up at Turtle Mountain. Uh, and of course, uh, you know, a shout out to all the leaders, but uh, M Monica from from MHA has been great uh, working with Catherine on a number of, of things. She re received recognition at the Recovery Reinvented, but uh, thank you, Chairman Fox. Thanks for your leadership on, uh, on the tribal taxation efforts, but uh, we got a great crew of folks here. Thank you, thank you all for being here, and uh, we look forward to continuing to work with you.